mighty and beloved presence of God, as we open in this moment, it is our intention to open to the realms of 100% pure light and truth. It is our intention to open to the realms of 100% pure light from the divine heart and mind. We ask assistance in this moment from the angelic realm, the ascended masters, and the beings of light who are always in selfless service to humanity, working in accordance with our divine unfolding and highest good. We ask for your assistance today in setting space where we are, creating a sacred vibration that will hold, surround, and uplift us. We ask for assistance in the removal of blocks, anything that interferes with our awakening consciousness, deepening perception, and our experience of our authentic and divine spark. We know as we ask, it is always given, and we are most grateful. Amen. I want you to imagine that bubbling up in the floor just beneath your feet is a beautiful pool of brilliant white light and into this pool of white, you are going to see the color of green, deep and rich, beautiful and vibrant. It mixes with the white. It is beautiful. It is perfect. And it is divine light. We're going to invite this light into the body, allowing the light, white and green, to flow through the soles of our feet and begin filling our body, starting with the toes. Once the toes are filled with light, it pours into the foot, all the way to the heel, and up into the ankle. Once saturated, the light flows up into the lower leg, expanding into the cells and atoms, easily, effortlessly, light expanding into the lower leg, filling the calves and shin, the brilliance of white and the beautiful shades of green pouring all the way up to the knees. From our knees, the light flows gently, steadily up into the thighs as it fills each cell and atom it releases from it any lower frequencies or vibration, any blocks, traumas, anything that is stored there that no longer serves our highest good. Light expanding, building, radiant, flowing forth until the thighs are filled all the way to the hips. You begin to feel the vibration of light on the body now as it's going deep and deeper still, elevating, uplifting, and quieting. The light begins to pour forth again. It begins to fill the body cavity, the lower torso. The perfection of white and green floods the base chakra. Deep, rich green pouring into this red center. The light flows to the back and enters the base of the spine. The most brilliant light filling the lower body, pouring up the spine. It reaches the level of the sacral chakra and flows into this center, making it brilliant with light. It fills the cells, atoms, systems, organs, the lower body filling with light all the way to the level of your solar plexus. And we'll hold the light here for a moment while it goes deep and deeper still into this center. It is now working to clear, release, open, and balance solar plexus, sacral, and root. 
dissolving, transmuting, and melting away every frequency that is less than this perfection of divine and unconditional love that is filling you. You begin to feel the solar plexus quiet just a bit as they are coming into alignment and balance. And then the light begins to pour up the spine, the brilliance of white and the vibrant rich green begins to move towards the physical heart and heart chakra. It also begins to pour up into the upper torso, it begins to flood the lungs in the front and back, light pouring up, filling the rib cage, filling the back and chest, saturating the lungs, pouring into the physical heart and heart chakra. The body is becoming so brilliant with light, the perfection of white, the vibration of green, saturating everything all the way up to the shoulders. And then the light begins to flow down the arms, all the way to the tips of the fingers and thumb. It fills them. It fills the hands. It fills wrists to elbow, and then elbow back to shoulders. The body now from the neck down to the toes is filled with light, divine light the perfection of love, unconditional, pulsing through the body, melting all the trauma, blocks, discord, everything that is less than this perfected vibration of light. You feel the activity of light working on the physical body. You feel it at the heart center as this chakra is moving into a state of balance as it clears and opens. It begins to align the lower chakras to it. You feel the movement in your physical body, your energy body, all percolating with light. It then begins to pour up the spine once again, flowing into the neck, flooding the throat chakra with the brilliance of white and green. It completely consumes the spine and neck all the way to the base of the brain. Here it splits into two streams, one pouring into the back of our brain, the other into the front of our skull. Light pouring into the head, front and back, two streams of light consuming us, two streams moving towards the third eye chakra. It flows into this center, filling the indigo center with brilliant light, the perfection of divine and unconditional love pouring forth, releasing the blocks, the interference, anything that is in the way of our deeper perceptual vision is now being surrounded, uplifted, and dissolved. The back of your head filled with light, your face filled with light, third eye brilliant, and then the two streams move towards the crown where they converge upon themselves. And once they do, the light goes deep 
to fill any remaining cells of your physical body. And once done, it begins to pour out through your crown. This activity of light pouring through the crown makes visible the soft outline of your fourth dimensional solar spine of light. You see that the light of white and green is pouring up the spine of light, the spine of many colors. This spine attaches to your physical spine through a bridge of light and this fourth dimensional spine moves all the way up several feet above you until it enters into a radiant golden sun above you, which is the I am present. See the light flowing out of the crown. See it moving up the solar spine. See it moving in to this miniature brilliant star that is above you. So beautiful so radiant, it is almost difficult to see even with your ethereal eyes. Imagine that you are now moving your consciousness up from the root chakra, sacral and solar plexus, all the way up until it is there at the heart center. We are pulling our attention into the physical heart and heart chakra. We feel ourselves moving inward, and at the same time, we feel ourselves becoming expansive as we concentrate our attention in this area. From inside, we can look up through the crown into the brilliant sun I am above us. We see that emanating out of this brilliant golden sun is a cylinder of white light, the perfection of the divine. It moves down from the sun above. It moves down in through and around us where we sit in our chair, down through the building we are in, down through the earth, its many layers of rock, crystal, water, and soil to anchor at the center of the planet in a liquid golden sun of immense radiance and beauty below us. Here we are held in this sacred and divine embrace of the masculine and feminine, heaven and earth. Here we are held by the frequencies of unconditional love. The cylinder of white is always present, always vibrating around us. We are always there contained within its vibration and frequency of love. Imagine that from inside yourself, you can look up into the sun above and look down the spine, out through the base, through the earth star chakra, into the golden radiant sun below. Imagine, if you will, in your mind's eye, that birthing out of the liquid sun below are tongues of violet fire, small tongues of fire that begin to grow until the raging inferno of holy fire is blazing out of the liquid sun. We call it forth, asking it to blaze up the cylinder, completely filling the cylinder with sacred fire violet, some purple and gold, moving up the cylinder, 
growing in intensity and vibration as it moves up from the sun. We ask that it blaze in through and around our physical body, where we are floating in the cylinder of white, blazing through our physical body, blazing out into our energy bodies, allowing the flames of holy fire to blaze up above us, all the way up until the flames are blazing into the golden sun I am above. We ask that this accelerated vibration of love bring healing, transformation to all misqualified energy that is in, through, and around us. We ask that it blaze out into everything we have ever said or done in this embodiment, in every embodiment, whether it is past, present, future, parallel, other dimensions or realities, wherever we have acted in fear rather than love, we ask that it be returned to its perfected state and vibration of light. And we'll hold a moment, just a moment, to experience the intensity, the beauty of this transformational energy of light as it reclaims, transmutes, and realigns. It is returning each of us to the perfection that we are. Elevating the vibration and bringing a sense of calm and stillness to body, mind, and emotion. While this activity of holy fire blazes on, bringing us into greater and greater vibrational frequencies of light. Looking up through the crown into the I am sun, it becomes easier and easier to perceive the golden radiance as it is cascading down in through and around us as we are floating in our cylinder of white a blaze within the violet, filled with the white and the deep and rich vibrant green, consuming our physical and energy cell. Feel the cascade of radiant gold. Feel it upon your face. Feel it upon your body. Feel it at the heart center. Imagine in your mind's eye that moving down from the I am sun above, moving down into the solar spine, is a stream of light so brilliant, so beautiful. It is pouring down the spine, pouring down through the crown, through the center of your brain, conducted on the bridge of light, connecting the solar spine to the physical spine. It is blazing now down 
into the physical spine, down through the throat, down past the heart, solar plexus, sacral. It is pouring down through the root. It is pouring down through the earth star. And then this light begins to pour down through the layers of earth until it begins to pour into the heart of the sun at the center of our planet. This is the Hara energy, the Hara energy of the masculine aspect of God. We are the conduit through which it passes. It moves through us in the most perfect and complete way when we are open and aligned. As it pours into the heart of the sun, into the heart of the Divine Feminine, true intercourse takes place between the masculine and feminine aspect of the Divine. And the explosion of balance takes place within the sun at the center of the planet. See the expansion of light at the core. See the heart of the sun growing more radiant and beautiful. We are going to call forth this balance of masculine and feminine, we're going to call forth now this chi. Seeing as it begins to look like a small cord or rope of light begins to pour back up simultaneously with the light of the divine above pouring down. It may look like golden light, rainbow light, light, brilliant and divine, moving up, moving up, moving up, until it pierces the earth star chakra, enters the base of our spine, through the root chakra, and moves up to just below the navel, where it begins to pool at the first point of the Dantian in the physical body. The Hara energy exists within the fifth dimension. It connects us into our etheric bodies. It is the balanced energy of yin and yang that feeds us, nourishes us, strengthens us. As we call this energy forth from below, this balanced of the two aspects of the divine, it begins to pool in the belly. A golden sphere of light begins to appear and you begin to feel the warmth as it begins to radiate out like a sun, a tiny miniature sun of golden light. It is radiating out into the lower chakras, strengthening, aligning, bringing physical vitality, health, stability, both emotional, mental, and physical. We are going to spend a moment holding this visual of light pouring down and returning back up 
filling the reservoir within the body. Filling the reservoir. This is where we tap into the sea of chi, a vital life force that sustains our physical experience, our physical, emotional, and mental body that sustains our energetic bodies. We're calling forth to the angels, Metatron, Raphael, and all others who are engaged in the work of repairing, unblocking, opening, and strengthening the Hara. Our connection to this fifth dimensional flow of Chi and our return to physical health, vitality, and perfection. Imagine in your mind's eye that this line of light is being handed to you to hold between your outstretched hands. Imagine you are looking at it. What is the condition of it? Is it broken, frayed, blocked? Is it brilliant with light? or dull. Imagine as you are holding it there between your hands that it is just a few feet long, just a miniature of its true size, that you are witnessing in this moment its return to its perfection anywhere that it is frayed, is repaired, anywhere that it is blocked, it is being opened, anywhere that it is being broken, it is made whole. See the light coming up until it is so brilliant and bright, you can barely look at it with your ethereal eyes. Imagine now that it is being placed back between the liquid heart of the sun and the Dantian sun at the point at your belly. You can feel it now as it is vibrating, pulsing with the activity of light moving up, the balanced light of masculine and feminine, the perfection of the divine entering into the Dantian. Feel the expansion at the Dantian, its warmth, as it begins to burn away everything that interferes with the balance and restoration of the lower chakras. Moving into harmony, balance, and alignment with the Hara line and filling the reservoir of the Dantian is one of the single most important activities of light we can bring to the body. When we are vertically aligned with source light, all things flow unobstructed to us, gently, tenderly, and perfectly. We no longer sense the anxiety, the chaos, the difficulties of the world in the same way. 
we feel strong and resilient emotionally, centered mentally. We feel clear. We feel healthy. We feel strong. This is our innate right as beings in a third dimensional experience. In order to fill the reservoir at the Dantian, we need only visualize the Hara moving up from the heart of the liquid sun below, entering through the base chakra and filling the reservoir of light that has been established just below the navel. We must call it forth in our mind's eye. We must intend it so in order for it to enter the body. We need only give attention to it for a moment. From the reservoir at the belly, we see the thin line of light moving up the spine, opposite the line of energy moving down, up past the heart and throat, up through the center of our brain and the third eye, out of the crown, up through the solar spine. This light moving all the way up into the golden sun I am above us, completing its circuit of energy from above and below. You will feel the activity of light at your center as everything is moving into a stronger alignment and balance with the two suns. And you will witness in this moment the pervasive, calm, quiet, and peace that has moved into the body into the mind and into the emotion. This is a platform of strength. We are in a place of great resilience, calm, we have entered into a place of stillness and quiet from this simple activity of light. Reclaiming our alignment with the Hara line and the Dantian pool of light. Ever so quiet. yet strong, vibrant, everything feeling complete and whole.
It is now time to bring our attention back to the heart center. Witnessing within the spine itself, the cascade of light moving down and the movement of light moving up. Always checking in to make sure that the flow of light from above and below is moving in its perfected state of balance, moving us between the two suns, masculine and feminine. and bringing us into greater and greater states of divine awareness. It is a simple thought away, a simple image brought to mind. Calls the energy down and up and fills the body with the light of the two suns. It is now time to release the violet fire. We thank it for its work of accelerating our healing and return to perfection watching as it begins to burn out, ceasing to flow, to blaze out of the liquid sun below, the perfection of violet fire blazing up the cylinder until it all disappears into the I am sun above us. We will remain forever within the cylinder of light, however, always, always bringing the visual of our vertical alignment to the two suns, to mind. We will remain filled with the perfection of white and the vibrant of the deep and rich greens that ground and awaken our heart. But it is now time to begin to send our consciousness back down the body, seeing to it that we are making connection with our solar plexus, sacral, root chakra, and earth star. It is time to begin to bring our senses back to our limbs feeling ourselves all the way down to the feet and down the arms to the hands. We would like to thank all of the beings of light who assisted us today, especially to the Archangel Raphael and Metatron who bring this work of healing the Hara, igniting the Dantian to humanity at this time. We are most grateful for this work this unconditional loving service. Thank you so much for assisting us today in all things expansive and beautiful. We thank all of the angels, ascended ones, and beings of light who were here to set space, transmute, and help to awaken. We are most grateful for your participation in our healing and awakening. We now ask that the meditation be brought to a close, that each one of us be shut down in every way we do not need to remain open and protected in every way that we do. See to it that each of us is brought into the perfection for our personal and individual third dimensional experience. We ask for your continued support and helping us to understand more fully all things experienced today, deepening our perception, deepening our awakening to truth and the authentic self. 
We know as we ask, it is always given, and we are most grateful. Amen. So we'll just take a moment now, just a small moment, to become more connected to our physical self. We feel the calm in the physical body, and yet we are becoming very present, returning to ourselves sitting in our chairs, returning to our physical self in a perfect and balanced way. And just take a few moments to fully reconnect. And when you are feeling like you are there, just simply open your eyes.